live from Los Angeles. Welcome back to Good Morning Lala. I'm so excited to welcome Aaron Jackson and Michael Kay to the show. You may recognize these two surf dudes from California Dream. I loved that show. <laughs> oh, you were the one? I was, the one. I was watching. You, you had such a run. I mean, it was almost like a sister show oh, to yeah. Save by the Bell. What was that journey like for you guys? Uh, it was, especially as a young adult, being uh, on a show like that, they bust in teenage girls, so we were way cooler than we were. Really <laughs> but it was awesome. I mean, we traveled the world. We, I mean, we literally played all day long from 10 to wow. 2 and... It, we got to just make people laugh. Yeah. It, was, it was pretty awesome. I, I came on um, third season, so I was kind of the new kid on the block. So they had had this such established relationship. So it was kind of like for me for the first, for the first you know six months, it was like, do I fit in with you guys? Because you guys are so cool. Right. Like, and it was like um, he didn't. <laughs> yeah, still did. um, but it, it was uh, it was it was playing. That's all we did all day. And the show play. truly though epitomized California dreams. Oh, it did. You know, rock and roll, the beach, good-looking mm -hmm. people. Mm -hmm. oh, live it was, yeah, <laughs> actually, it's fun. We actually have a look from the show. Let's take a peek. Oh, Jenny Stevens, huh? Man, she's good. All right, Jenny this, Jenny that, Jenny, Jenny, Jenny. Who cares about her? Uh, just a hunch, but I get the feeling you do. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. <laughs> I met her a couple years ago. <laughs> she was so hot, I couldn't even breathe. Hot? I like it. I like it. <laughs> we were like meant to be. I even told her I loved her. Wow. Oh. Uh, let me get this straight. You said you loved her so you can get her to kiss you, right? No, I said it because I meant it. You disgust me. <laughs> get on ready. <laughs> okay, I want you to give me a happy, all right? Yeah. Sly, we need to talk. A big smile, big smile. Sly, what are you thinking? You can't sell your car. Yeah, think of all those girls who've slapped your face in the back seat. <laughs> ah, once I go pro, I'll be able to get my face slapped in a dozen cars. I'll feel, excuse me, my fans are waiting. Oh my yeah. God! So First of all, I'd like to thank you because um, I was really trying to get another acting job. And that <laughs> reminded, everybody, reminded everybody that I can't act. So thank you. Awesome. So but it you're been, shredded. So, oh, so you. I'm curious to know because obviously you could look at this and go, "It's a total celebration. You're coming back together. It's a celebration." And then some people really have an identity. They they identify with some oh past my. thing, and it's hard for them to move past that and make new creations. Well, that's their own problem. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they what's, need that, what's that been like? For you guys it's awesome i mean i we impacted a lot of people growing up everybody who, who recognizes us or comes up to us always says i remember this they say thank you for my child i mean the the emails the the comments we you know we grew up with you we've really made well he didn't but made an <laughs> impression on somebody and it'll never change will it yeah no you, you'll never be nice to me no, <laughs> I, so. no I, I did give you compliments uh, yeah. no but we we uh yeah the, we impacted somebody who was so young and they, they took us with them the wow. whole journey it was awesome what's that like it's like you're like family. I think a lot of the daytime uh, television also, especially as people are, they, they consider you family. You're in their living yes. rooms mm -hmm. with them. That was the hardest. Like for us, you know, when people would come up to us and call us, you know, Mark or Sly, it's like, we're actually people, right? We're actually like, Hi, I'm man. a person. <laughs> <laughs> this is my, uh, and, 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 you know, how they said that we changed their lives, like that our episodes, you know, because we were politically correct. We did everything possible to mm -hmm. Peter was the way that they wrote the show that they made it that everything in a moral. And it was, mm -hmm. they said that, oh, you did this for us or you helped us get through this. And it was like, that was life changing for them. And then for us looking back on it 20 years right. later, it is so like, so what was the moral of the story for you guys? It changed every week, but for me, it was it was just kindness, um, mm. loving one another, um, respecting each other. Mm. You know, um, and, and I'm gonna cry. No, it, it so <laughs> was. Loving I mean, them. we were such a family. The seven of us were like we're still so close, right. yeah. really close. Like, I haven't seen him in it, it's been 20 years since we've physically seen each other. Wow. wow. We went out to dinner the other night, and it was like we went to the same restaurant that we always went to. Get your hands off my shirt. <laughs> <laughs> it, was, uh, it was like nothing changed. Years. Nothing, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Um, Kelly and Jenny, and they really wanted to come, but their vo voices are gone, gone from rehearsal. 
so they, they're not talking for two days now, but uh, they give their, their love as well. Um, yeah, like for me, I was like the, the goofball, the, you know, the comedy relief, and all I just cared about was making a fool of myself so I could make somebody else laugh and forget mm-hmm. about whatever they're going through. That's amazing. Wow. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. When you look back now, mm-hmm. are there, is there anything you would tell like your, the younger version of yourself? You know, anything you know now that maybe you didn't know then that you wish you knew then? How long is this show? <laughs> <laughs> You're a doctor, right? <laughs> Man. Okay. <laughs> um, Tell us started with my mom. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I mean, seize the day, take chances, take risks. I had a lot of opportunities that I was like, this is going to come again. Yeah. I don't need Embrace every opportunity. Jeslyn Earmuffs. She's yeah. on yes. Yeah, she's Girl, she yes says yes girl, to right? all the fantastic oh, that, experiences and events. Oh, we love that about her. My, my, good, but you need to learn to say no. <laughs> I try. Yeah. So, what would yours be? Mine was, um, I got this tattoo, not because of the show, but it was part of the show, because it's the giving tree. Mm-hmm. Oh. And and I, I, I wish I would have, not that we didn't give, but I wish I would have given more, like mm-hmm. just to everything, you know, because mm-hmm. being blessed to move here from, from Pennsylvania and, and get the Hollywood dream. We had the Hollywood dream, yeah. mm-hmm. and we never took it for granted. But I wish I would have done more with it, mm-hmm. not celebrityism wise, but just doing more for others. So this is a, a constant reminder of, of to, to always give. That's mm-hmm. awesome. That was I love it. The, the show. The show. Well, gave tell me people that. where they can find you and get your your comeback get back together mm-hmm. as getting the band back together. Yeah. Um, well, unfortunately, the show is sold out. Um, Fortunately, you're still that. Yes. Cool. Yeah, I know. We, in seconds, too. thirty seats. I mean, yeah. no picture. Yeah. <laughs> so, but <laughs> for your family and I. <laughs> they asked me a question. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, the, um, we uh, we have meet and greet as from six to seven. So mm-hmm. you can come and meet the cast and the crew, and you know we have producers coming. We have the the people who did all the music. Um, so from six to seven, you can come say hey. But if not, um, YouTube us. Yeah. And Instagram. Instagram uh, at Michael Cade. I'm um, Aaron Cal Dreams underscore. Awesome. So awesome. Appreciate you guys. Great. Uh, so fun, guys. Thank you. Awesome Stay tuned. Thank you we'll guys. be right back. <laughs>